This is the Daily Market Comment by Mario Sajikiriakos. I'm Maria Pashurdis. Thanks for joining us at XM.com. It was an explosive session across financial markets on Tuesday as risk aversion made a rare comeback. The general theme was fear, but with a pandemic-style flavor. Investors essentially slashed their exposure to assets that are linked to the real economy and looked for shelter in safe havens. This dichotomy was crystal clear in the equity market, where old economy stocks took a hit even as several tech titans managed to power to new record highs, highlighting the defensive nature of tech plays during this crisis. When markets are worried about economic growth, digital stocks usually shine while traditional stocks get hammered. Across the risk spectrum, the US dollar shined bright alongside the Japanese yen as traders sought protection. But the dash for safety was even clearer in the bond market. Treasury yields fell substantially as money managers bought bonds to hedge their exposure to riskier assets. This is usually a bad sign. When investors are willing to buy an asset that's guaranteed to lose the money just for safety, they are typically afraid something big is coming. The catalyst behind all this mayhem wasn't entirely clear, although the disappointing ISM Services survey definitely added fuel to the moves, perhaps by intensifying worries that we've already hit peak growth. In the commodity sphere, oil prices got knocked down as the cautious mood in the broader market joined forces with worries that the divisions within OPEC might lead some producers to stop complying with their supply quotas. The negotiations continue, with the Biden administration also lobbying for a deal that stabilizes energy markets. Meanwhile, gold prices were trapped between opposing forces. The decline in real yields initially boosted bullion, but most of the gains evaporated as the dollar stormed higher. That said, the bulls are still in the driver's seat as the yellow metal continues to push higher today, capitalizing on another decline in yields but a stable dollar. As for today, the minutes of the latest FOMC meeting could determine whether this volatility episode continues or fades out. The Fed wants to see a few more solid jobs reports before getting the ball rolling, likely by sending a strong tapering warning in August. In this sense, the outlook for the dollar remains promising. This was today's Daily Market Comment. Thanks for joining us at XM.com.